So what's going on guys, Mr. Dalek JD here and welcome back to another video. Now today we're going to be talking a little bit about Exo Zombies Descent, the last and final Exo Zombies map we're going to be getting in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare in the Reckoning DLC pack coming August 4th. You can check out a full breakdown of the trailer in the link below which I uploaded yesterday of the time of this video going up. But I want to speak to you a little bit more in depth about a find that I noticed during the trailer which can open up and give us a little bit more information and backstory onto what's going on in this map and what we could possibly expect and it all involves Oz, the most important character in Exo Zombies right now and a little bit to describe what exactly is going on in this map and how exactly Oz is changing. Now just before I jump into this guys, if you enjoy this make sure to subscribe, I'll be able to bring you guys some early gameplay of Exo Zombies Descent in the next week or so before the map pack comes out so make sure you're subscribing and following me down below on Twitter and Facebook so I can keep you updated on when I can drop that for you. But let's talk about Oz. Now, I noticed something in this trailer which you guys may have noticed as well and it's right at the end we see this weird clip of what seems to be this huge kind of mutated monstrosity that we've never seen before in Exo Zombies and looks like sort of like half cross of a zombie, half cross of some weird sort of alien. It's got huge hands, it's got spikes coming out of his body but the most important shot in this little kind of scene looking at this crazy zombie mutated thing is the fact it's got knee pads. Now this is very very weird of a feature to have on such a weird horrific monster and these knee pads actually relate to a character in Exo Exo Zombies, and that's right, it's none other than Oz. Throughout our time in Exo Zombies, Oz has been wearing the same outfit which contains the exact same knee pads. Now we see at the start of this trailer, it seems that Oz is becoming even more zombified than we saw at the end of the carrier cutscene uh, when you completed the map and you saw that Oz is like kind of half human, half zombie. He seems to recognize Lilith, but then he goes to attack our characters, and now he seems he's in full-fledged zombie mode and he's out to get revenge on our characters for some reason and not, not too sure what exactly has happened in this map but Oz is somehow turned himself into some huge mutated zombie boss. Now reading the bio of Oz it says that people saw what they wanted to in Oz. Some sort of man with a wrench who could fix the faulty cooling system, other sort of man with a mop who cleaned up coffee spills. If anyone had bothered to look deeper they might have got a glimpse of the true Oz, the one he kept hidden, the one that witnessed hundreds die in combat a monster that screamed into his face in the mirror. All Oz wanted was a simpler life, to stay off the grid. He even chose a low rank Atlas job to do it. Surely that would be enough, right? Now looking at the bio, the most interesting bits is the one that say that we could have gotten a glimpse of the true Oz if anyone bothered to look deeper, the one that he kept hidden, the one that witnessed hundreds die in combat. Now we know that for some reason Oz has been like the, the, the first person to be kind of injected with this infection uh, by Atlas to test about the zombie infection which is how he is a zombie at the moment. Now what could have happened is this could have been some sort of mutated version of this uh, strange of infection when injected into him originally which turned him into a zombie and now is turning him into something even more so than a zombie either that's one reason to explain why he's become this monster or it could be that Oz is not happy with what's happening to him he's no longer in control fully of his human thoughts and he's almost in a way possessed by power now he is this zombie and he wants to become something even more than a zombie to try and take down our crew of characters because he does look like he's about to attack them in the start of this uh, cutscene for this map and I can only assume that since this is the last map things are going to go out with a huge bang and there's going to be some explanation for why Oz has turned into this huge monstrosity. Now if you've been following along with the storyline from Exo Zombies Carrier we learned that Atlas created this global pandemic as a way of making ridiculous amounts of money and the description for this map says that our heroes unravel the true cause of the global pandemic and the terrible secret that Atlas has been hiding. So Atlas could have been hiding this like kind of strain of the infection even more so to test on Oz which has caused him to turn into this huge monster which is going to try and destroy the crew and create even more chaos on the world so that Atlas can make even more money almost using Oz as kind of like their kind of pet monkey to do as they please to cause chaos and to create even more ways for them to make money. But in terms of this effect 
affecting the gameplay. I feel like this is going to be some huge boss round or maybe even something which happens during a round. It could potentially be a sort of end game boss where you come across this mutated version of Oz and then once you manage to take him down you can escape the map and that will be it. I'm not too sure. I have no idea how exactly this boss plays in terms of the gameplay. I'm very very excited to see how this looks because at the end it kind of looked sort of cinematic, sort of actual in-game footage as well. So it'll be interesting to see how it is. But let me know your thoughts down below on how you think Oz as this weird mutated boss is going to be incorporated into the gameplay and what your ideas and thoughts are of Oz becoming this thing and why he became this thing. But if you guys enjoyed it, smash that like button. I'll be coming out with a load more videos regarding ExoZombies Descent and when it releases, I'll bring you guys some epic videos as well. Make sure to subscribe if you're new and I'll catch you for another video very, very soon.